four goals to his name this evening. He is on the tail of Luis Garcia, who's the top scorer with six goals. So isn't it a little bit of a battle on the carpet for the award of top goal scorer between those two? Team comes first. Both sets of players want their hands on lifting that trophy. Danny Gibson's already scored a beauty of a goal earlier on this evening and he'll be looking to pull off quality like that once again joining me in commentary for the grand final is Celtic player Stan Petrov Stan what are your memories of watching the rivalry between Liverpool and Manchester United oh, it was going to be a, good, a very good game two, two very good teams they settled really well into the tournament the movement is really good Stuart Downing and uh, Luis Garcia has been really good for uh, Liverpool their pace their technique it makes the difference but Man United seems like they just set up as a defence display but they're just counter-attacking very very well we are underway and this man Luis Garcia you expect will have a very big say in things over the next 16 minutes O'Shea lays off Gibson you can already see an increase in the energy the will and desire in the start of this one that is why the Liverpool really strong wingers here pulling away from the defenders and that is a great save, great save from... Beautiful little step okay, over yes. to just let the ball run through Stan. Yeah, he just, he seems like Luis Garcia, he's enjoying every, every moment, every touch, just try to entertain the fans. I think he could keep going, he'll probably be able to go until the wee hours of the morning. Yeah, he does, he's, he still look after himself, he looks sharp, he looks... His brain is really good and you can see he's just waiting for them to, to get the ball and just play it forward. The sooner they play it forward, his reaction is incredible. But that's where Man United is going to be, really hurt uh, Liverpool, just keeping the ball and be patient. Now being patient here, Chris Eagles, former Burnley, Bolton Wanderers, Sheffield Wednesday player, also had a spell up here in Scotland with Ross County. Great to push that one through for Paborski. Great defensive display from Robbie Fowler. Not a natural position, but he's doing it. He's doing it for the team. He's done that a few times tonight as well. He's hung back at times just to play that defensive role. You have to, you have to. You just you just can't have people that don't track runners. You can see it straight away. Now he's moving into the middle and he just accept one trick to take the ball. But that's where Liverpool really goes, especially with Stewie Downing and Luis Garcia. You can see he's dropping nice and deep and just playing the little passes. But he's so fit, he moves away straight, so naturally. Look at him, he's all wonderful. Hard to keep a track of. Scored in the last match against Manchester United. Tennant. Ah, oh, it's a good defending, that from down Gibson. Great defending. This is where the legs are really getting tired now, and you just wait, you wish that they don't turn and twist. I can imagine, Stan. <laughs> The heat up here is bad, so I can't imagine what the heat's like down there. I've heard the players talking about it. Oh, it's Liverpool pressing really high. This is where that Liverpool can win the game. It's like they're fitter, they, they look sharper, and then and now start pushing a bit further forward. Paul Rahudka with the ball out of play. There's been some brilliant efforts from the crowd this evening. They're always ready for the ball going in there, ready to get a header or they've been a get something on it. Electric, they're electric. They've been, they've been tuning every tackle, every every pass, every every shot and especially goal. That's where it's really good. This is what he's, he's good at. There you go. Garcia for Fowler and Robbie Fowler gets another against Manchester United and puts Liverpool in front. Again, a little magic from uh, from Luis Garcia getting the ball, moving in, in field and just setting nicely at Robbie Fowler. You never going to miss it from that position. You can see on the replay, Garcia just tips the defender out and then stabs the ball into the path of Fowler. Is, and is, Liverpool ahead. Yeah, it's the timing of the pass as well. He's just waiting for the for the, um, for the the defender just to oh, make the know. challenge. He just top pocket there and it's great finish from Fowler. Manchester United looking to hit back. Luis Saha looking to get on the score sheet has been limited tonight due to an injury Liverpool being really, Liverpool being really really organised oh great great interaction from uh, Stuart Downing he's been defending as well he's been playing as a left fullback oh, oh brilliant finish from Luis Saha he does have his goal now 
you can see J Jamie Harden is not happy. He wants the change. He, he sees that his teammates don't don't react very well, and it's a great finish from Luis Saha. And he has Fowler and Carragher there, and he manages to just get in the middle of both and give himself a, a view at goal. Yeah, you just, you just don't let Luis Saha in this position because he can finish left and right. He can finish nicely. Just guide the ball into the net. from David Thompson. Was that a cross? Well, that's a great finish. Yeah. It's a lovely finish. Lovely finish. But again, Liverpool just break his shot quickly and just using these wide areas where there's a plenty of space. This is just easy across, but what a finish. We'll take as a finish. He opens up his foot so well and guides it into that far corner. And Liverpool now 2-1 in front. Fowler opened the scoring, Saha hit back. David Thompson gets his second of the evening. Oh, they just said quickly. Look how quickly they're, they're just breaking. It's a good pressure from Man United. Saha wriggling away. And the last goal scorer, Thompson. Paborski now, lovely flick. Around Vesterveld. Ah, uh, again, three on one. Picks out Thompson. Stan says three on one. O'Shea, a lonely man. Garcia! Oh. Or Pennant, he might still get the chance. Yeah. And he scores! This is where the legs are really tired. The bouncing off the board. Reaction for Jermaine Pennant is really, really good. But again, Thompson and uh, the link up play between Luis Garcia and Thompson, really good. And obviously the reaction from Pennant. 3 1. It's Pennant's first goal of the night, but all that was created by Jimmy Carragher's pass from the back. Oh, that, that, that transition is so quick. They, they see the pass quickly, and they, the players are willing to go for it because they know now Man United are really tired and don't react when they lose the ball. Manchester United will want to get another back before the interval. Just under a minute and a half to do so. Liverpool really set up well. They really find out the balance of the of the tournament. You can see there's a plenty of space. Luis Garcia just so patient, and there you go, he just moves in. And with this technical ability, oh, great pressure from Darren Gibson. Now is a chance for. Oh, I've been there, yeah. I know how difficult it is. I've been there. I've been there. I think everyone has tonight, Stan. I yeah, think it's, it's been that kind of night, hasn't it? Everyone wants to get on the score sheet. Tired mind, tired legs. I know how that feels. The main tells you what you're doing, but the foot really doesn't yes. pull it off. Again, Luis, Luis Garcia just moving into this space, to the space, making sure he, he controls the ball, he holds the ball for the team. And now they're overloading nicely. Carragher, 30 seconds to go now until half-time break. Downing. Pennant scored the most recent goal. There are matches for Liverpool over three seasons. Tanfield. Really patient, really patient. They're moving the ball, they're waiting for their chance, making sure they've got the chance to score a goal. They don't want to lose the ball. Because Weber now is, is, is on and he's he's quick. This is what is it. As soon as they get the ball, there's no time for yes. Weber. The buzzer sounds. Manchester United have it all to do in the second half of this Masters Cup final. 3 1 down. Danny Weber will play an important part of Manchester United are to get their hands on the trophy at the end of this evening. Jermaine Pennant, the most recent goal scorer with the third for Liverpool. Here are the goals. It's Garcia showing his class once again, setting up Fowler. Let it run across his body and with the left foot, put it high into the net. He's just a composer from uh, Robbie Fowler. He's, he knows that the keeper is big. He just makes sure that he's just going to hit the target in the right way. A smooth move from Louis Saha. An even smoother finish from David Thompson there. Garcia's shot rebounded off the glass. Jermaine Pennant was there at the back post to make no mistake. There is Robbie Fowler taking a little bit of a break at half time. His side are in full control. 3-1 ahead against Manchester United. Comfortable, but with so much potential for more goals in the second half from them. But also from the Manchester United team, 
we see Pavorsky, Eagles, O'Shea, Gibson all on the score sheet. Saha and Danny Weber too. There's the competitive side of a John Shea. Just made sure they don't, they won't break quickly. But you can see the Luis Garcia, he just, just stays so long. He just be stays between the goalkeeper and the defender. Make sure that his movement of the shoulder and make sure he's always available when the ball is, can be played forward. There he goes, straight away. His movement is incredible. Gibson battles away. Garcia, it's Darren Gibson who has it. On! Westerveld oh. hasn't taken it. And Manchester United have been gifted the way back into the final. 3-2. Great, great, great strike. And also, the keeper should do much better. But you don't shoot, you don't score. That's what you do. You've got plenty, plenty of chances. And Darren Gibson, he's been scoring some good goals today. One to in. And this one, I bet, I bet he's going to just take it and just enjoy as well. We heard Roy Carroll earlier say that goalkeepers are getting tired out there too, though, Stan. Of course. Plenty, into it. plenty of shots today. You see, the, people, the, uh, the players are starting to shoot more because, you know, the legs are tired and it's more opportunities to shoot and the keepers have to be really switched on. Jamie Carragher. That one just wide. One, 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 one. Just to let you know, Stan, we've been tasked with the job of picking a player of the match. And this one too. Play of the tournament, plenty, sorry. Plenty, plenty to go, plenty of time to go. It's a few more twists and turns in that game. Three you can see. Yeah, it's great. It's easy, easy because Thompson just, just got into the opposition half and you're not allowed to do that. But now you can see Liverpool are just setting back and waiting for, the, for, the, for Manchester United to, to make a mistake. And Man United now, they'll push it really, really hard. Again. Man United still in control, still very composed on the ball. Darren Gibson, he's been moving, he's been waiting for that opportunity to take a, to take a shot. Oh. Liverpool still in the lead though, and there's Weber, there is a... they're no longer in the lead. I said, I said it's 3-3, three, three. Danny Weber does it again. Great skills, just move away from the from the defender and just a great finish, great finish in the far corner. Just drop the shoulder, Jamie Carter, slow reaction, then 3-3, three, three. what a game we've got. I told you, see, with a few twists and turns still to go. Just over five minutes. Score locked at 3-3. Who will come out winners? The 360 Sports TV Masters Cup. Fowler sets up Stuart Downing and drills in a beauty. Liverpool four, Man United three. With his quality, with his that, with the sweet left foot, it's an incredible finish. Head down and just a great strike from Stuart Downing. You can see now. Head down, concentration, not tiredness at all, perfect strike. Catches it so sweetly, and it's his third of the evening in the tournament as well. Doing some impressive performances for Liverpool. You can see now, Jermaine Pennant just stuck in the back. He's moved up to do the defensive duty. Now Manchester United they have to be really, really patient when they have the extra man in, the, in their half make sure that they've got opportunity to strike. Kelly Saha in a tight spot. Halfway point of the second half. This is, this is where Gibson, he, needs, he must get that opportunity to take a strike. That's where he's good at making sure. Oh, what a turn. What a turn for Danny Weber. He's been lively tonight, he's been lively tonight. He's been the one that, who's get the ball, make sure he hold it, twist and turn, and he always look for that strike. So difficult to play against this evening. Believe me, it's really difficult. O'Shea. For Gibson. Evade Saha. Liverpool look to counter. Luis Garcia could be one on one with a hoop car, and he just puts that wide with the outside of his foot. Great reaction from He's still him. there, Great he's reaction. taking a sore one. Oh, another miss. 
great reaction from, from, from Luis, Luis Garcia, especially when, when he missed that chance. Just a reaction, Jermaine Pennant, he just couldn't finish. Fowler. Carragher. A couple of final boos from the crowd for Liverpool defender. Liverpool in control now, they don't have to rush it, they have to make sure they control that ball, get that opportunity again. Another goal will finish the game. They need to be smart with the ball. You can see experience of the players, they know what they're looking for, they know they're waiting for it, and this is a ah, great flick. They keep possession as long as possible for the final two and a half minutes. Ah. They will be crowned <laughs> Masters Cup 2022 champions. Weber and Saha link up, looking for an equaliser. Ah, oh. so almost passes that one into the hands of Vesterveld. You can see that the, the reaction from Jamie Carragher, just you know, losing the ball, making sure you get back cover, and he don't like the, 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 the Luis Saha getting a, a nice touch and just to not finish it. This is where my, Man United really have to push now. They have to take that risk. He's on less than two minutes and they have to make sure that they've got another chance, at least another chance. Liverpool will want to keep the ball. There's no danger if they can do that. Pennant. Maybe tell that time, Carragher on the ball. That's why the composure is really important now for the players. Don't have to rush it. Don't have to go for a glory. This is where the mistake could happen. And that's it. Is this the moment at Manchester United level? Saha! Oh. Had support again. coming up on the far side, Stan. Yes, it's moving against Luis Garcia, just moving into a nice place, looking for that ball, making sure that he's always about. Again, he's from one side to another side. What a fitness. I think he can still play. Yeah. Plenty of scouts maybe tuned in this evening. They put a word in. Liverpool are just running down the clock with the ball here. Oh, what a great time. Garcia turns. Every time you speak about him, Stan, you're, you're so impressed. Yeah, he's just really impressed. He's really... Oh, there and he there he is. The icing on the cake from Luis Garcia. He's been outstanding tonight. He's moving in, he makes sure he takes the ball, he drives with the ball, one, two, and when he gets to the other side, he makes sure he drives and he gets into that box. And it's the icing on the cake for Liverpool. The countdown timer is on. Only 17 seconds remain on the pitch. Liverpool five, Manchester United three. Luis Garcia with some inspired performances for Liverpool tonight. Robbie Fowler clears the ball upfield. Three seconds, one second, and Liverpool are the 360 Sports Television Masters Cup champions. Luis Garcia adding to his goal tally. Top scorer of the tournament. But plenty of solid performances around from his teammates, Jamie Carragher played a big part both in defence and in attack too. Stan, Liverpool deserve winners. Fully deserve it. They've been they've been outstanding from the start. They've um, really have a balanced team. They managed to adapt to the to the tournament. They have some outstanding players. So Luis Garcia has been the driving force, scoring goals, creating goals, and making sure when the team is under pressure, he always produces. So, they have fully deserved it, and I think they, they can fully say they've been outstanding in this Masters tournament. The Liverpool supporters have been treated to a masterclass at times this evening. I'm watching their favourites play in the red, and it's a victorious return to Masters football for Liverpool. The champions at Brayhead Arena in Glasgow, here's how they did it. Garcia setting up Robbie Fowler to open the scoring. Luis Saha, a nice effort to get Manchester United level. But a beautifully caressed shot from David Thompson. But Liverpool in front again. Jermaine Pennant stretched the lead to 3 1. Gibson managed to get on the score sheet from a mistake from the Liverpool goalkeeper Vesterveld. Weber made it 3 3. But Liverpool didn't put their heads down. And Luis Garcia. 
managed to put the icing on the cake after Stuart Downing put Liverpool back into the lead again. Liverpool awaiting the trophy it will be presented to them. Jamie Carragher so successful in his time at Liverpool. 11 honours mentioned earlier, including that Champions League final in 2005. He starred the Masters football tonight to lead Liverpool to the trophy. And it was a real team effort throughout all the players. David Thompson, Stuart Downing, also impressive. And Sandra Westerveld as well. A big part in goal, but there is your player of the Masters Cup final tournament, Luis Garcia who's been outstanding fully, in all the games, Stan. Fully deserve it. Um, you know, he's been impressive. He just, he's not just scoring goals, creating. He just, he just movement. He's so, so intelligent. He knows where to move. He keeps it simple. He don't do step -offs. He just moved the ball, link up play. He, he had everything tonight. And he's, he was outstanding from the, game, the first game until the last game. So fully deserve it. Tap on the head from David Thompson. And the players go up to receive the trophy with the red ribbons Steve McManaman receiving his medal Robbie Fowler as well a couple of goals against Manchester United in the final two games Jermaine Pennant also got on the score sheet on the final Mr Vell's mistake didn't matter as he's a winner too Jamie Carragher can smile now and have a little bit of a laugh after yeah. all the competitiveness this evening. Yeah. Step behind the board in front of the teammates. The crowd, Liverpool supporters watching on. Liverpool are your 360 Sports TV Masters Cup champions. That's the, that's the great moment. This is what everything is all about. I mean, they, fully, they fully deserve it tonight. They've put all their efforts, they've, they've played some great football and uh, fully deserved the, the, the cup and the champagne as well. David Thompson looks like he's enjoying that. He scored the beauty of a goal to make it 2 1 in the final. And it's the Liverpool supporters who are happiest, but it's been a fantastic evening of Masters football here at Brayhead Arena. The noise throughout was electric. That old firm derby was fantastic. The noise was buzzing at Brayhead as Celtic and Rangers battled out a 2-2 drop. -two but it's Liverpool who defeated Manchester United in the final and they take the crown of the 360 Sports TV Masters Cup champions for 2022.